Liverpool have confirmed the 1st January departure after first team development coach Pep Leinders quit the club with immediate effect to take over as the head coach of Dutch club NEC Nijmegen. The 34-year-old joined the Reds in 2014 following stints with PSV Eindhoven in his homeland and Porto in Portugal. He started his stint in Liverpool as the under-16 coach, and was later promoted to the newly created role of first-team development coach in 2015 under Brendan Rodgers. Leinders then became a key member of Jurgen Klopp's backroom team when the German took over later in the year. The former Borussia Dortmund manager has paid a glowing tribute to Leinders while wishing him the best in his new role with the Dutch second-tier club. Klopp professed disappointment at his exit from the club, but admitted that it would have been unfair to hold him back from what is a great opportunity to further his coaching career. It's such a strange mix of emotions talking about Pep leaving us, Klopp was quoted as saying on Liverpool's official site, Firstly, I'm gutted to be losing such a valuable member of our coaching team and such a brilliant person from our group, but that is tempered by the fact I'm very excited for him to have this opportunity and, as much as we would have loved for him to remain with us, we cannot stand and in his way for what is a fantastic opportunity, the German coach added. Leinders was a valued member of the coaching staff and after three and a half years, he will leave the Reds with immediate effect to begin work with NEC, who play in the East Divisie the Dutch second division and are currently in second place, just one point behind leaders Fortuna Sittard. Jurgen Klopp has lost a key member of his coaching staff going into the second half of the season. Getty, the 34-year-old, penned an emotional tribute to Liverpool Football Club and its supporters and thanked everyone he has worked with during his time at the academy and at Liverpool's Melwood training base. I could write four hours thanking the people at Liverpool who have helped me since I came here and the decision to leave has not been easy, Landers wrote in his statement on Liverpool's official site. In general terms, I would like to thank all the amazing players and staff at Melwood within the academy at Kirby, who I have been privileged to work with. Also, at Anfield, that is such a special place with special people and I never took for granted going to work at one of the greatest stadiums in the world every other week. More specifically, I would like to thank Alex Inglethorpe, Michael Beale and Michael Edwards from the faith they showed in me, by giving me the opportunities here, the 34-year-old continued, to Brendan Rodgers, who promoted me to the first-team environment. I will always be in his debt for that, and, of course, Jürgen and his senior coaching staff. They took me, my wife and our children into their lives and hearts and made us feel part of the families also. This club is so, so lucky to have someone of Jurgen's calibre leading its football team. He is world class, truly world class and I hope to take many of the great lessons I learned from him. Selko Bovac, Peter Krawitz and John Arterberg into my own future leading aside, he added. Final thank you is to the amazing Liverpool supporters. No group of people in the world deserve success more than them and I know with the position D club is in, that success is not too far away.